so this is the last video for the Cadet 2 Trainer videos that I'll be doing. Um, we're finally going to build the much anticipated 2 input AND gate. The first thing that is needed is our actual AND chip, which is the 7408, which I have one right here. Um, you're going to want to make sure you place the chip in the right direction for where your power and ground go. Uh, just check your pin printout that has the chip diagram for the 7408. Um, VCC means power, and GND means ground, obviously. Uh, my pinout tells me that power is pin 14, which is the uh, top right here. Oh gosh, top right. And ground is 7, which is lower left. Um, if you've been following along with your own trainer, go ahead and take out the switch wire for now. And go ahead and place your 7408 hand chip uh, wherever you like. I'm just going to place mine here. Um, go ahead and make your strips. Go ahead and make sure that your strips both have power and ground. My vertical strip here has power. Uh, this vertical strip here has ground. And we can go ahead and wire the power and ground to the chip. So, power. Mm. Ground. Alright, so top right, pin 14, power, BCC, and bottom left, pin 7, uh, ground. So go ahead and take your switch, look back at your pin diagram, and you're going to notice that there's going to be four different gates on the chip. Um, I'm using pins 1, 2, and 3. Um, so go ahead and place your first switch into pin 1, which is one of the inputs to this AND gate. Take another wire and set up, just like we did in the last video, another switch. I'm going to use switch 2 and put that in pin number 2, which is another input. And now take your probing wire, which is connected to your logic monitor, and put that in 3, which is your output. So now, go ahead and start playing with the switches. Um, you'll see that I have a low. This is because both of my switches are off. Um, because it's an AND gate, you'll notice that anytime the switches are not both set to true or high, that you have a low output. Um, that's just how the boolean and works. Um, when you have both switches turned on, however, you can't see that, you'll get a high. So, uh, play around with that, and, uh, that's it. So, good luck on your future circuits!